this is the bearded sailor with you I'm gonna test ride the this is a 2019 chieftain with the cam 3116 kit should be stage 2 exhaust uh, my last of the day thinking this thing is gonna be pretty badass what I'm hearing This is what I'm used to, having these higher handlebars on it. Again, we're having issues with the, uh, the wind. The wind is uh, sort of at eye level. It's sort of the same, uh, again, as the uh, white horse, uh, I mean, uh, the dark horse, the uh, white one, <laughs> the white horse, white dark horse. So we're having that trouble again. But man, this is more comfortable. Let's see how this does. Maybe I'm gonna do better in turns this time. There we go. Now that I'm not afraid to lean this motherfucker over. It does have the uh, additional upgrade of the uh, hill shifter. You know what, and, and I have to admit, I'm not too familiar with those. But again, the shifting on this thing feels great. I feel like this does a lot better in turns than that other one. I don't know why. But again, maybe it's also because I'm probably used to the bike now. So, this bike, it has these, uh, you can tell it's uh, upgraded with these mini ape hangers on it. This is comfy. Um, with taller people like me, I mean, I'm almost six foot, so with the, the, the bikes like this, I'm pretty comfortable with my sitting. I'm not gonna mess with that anymore. <laughs> Try to get the radio to work. I'm not too familiar with the radios and these systems. And you know what the great thing is? I know this is a loud bike too. The uh, 116 in it, this bike is really loud behind. But you know what I noticed, which is great, and I have to mention, is that in front, like riding it, I can't even hear it. Like, I can hear the rumble, I can feel it. But you know what? It's a comfortable little rumble. It's nice. So again, this is a great feeling ride. I mean, what can I mean, what more can you ask from a 116? I mean, honestly, that's why I'm kind of quiet. I'm kind of quiet right now because, I mean, this is a, this is a very comfortable bike. I'm very comfortable, I'm nice and spread out. Again, because you have your mini, your your ape hangers on here, the ape hangers feel amazing on this thing. Um, but again, uh, the only the only complaint that I have, and you can put the 116 on any Thunderstroke. Um, again, the one complaint I have though is that you can get a bigger windshield, so this standard windshield is just, it's just not enough. The audio system sounds great though. From what I've heard so far. Uh oh, we got an idiot stopped up here. Come on. And then we got a person turning. Yep. How good this does on the on the highway. Woo! You know what I just don't like about these Indians is they have this they have these little tiny grips on them. Uh, that that would definitely be the first thing that I upgrade on this bike would be the grips because. Man, when those grips, they just, your hand gets fatigued like crazy. Overall, I mean, it was a great ride. Can't complain that 116 would, I mean, but the 116 kit, it's going to cost you. I think the upgrades on this thing are just crazy. 
I think it's like three grand, I think my father and I were talking to a person. Great bike though, overall. <sighs> All right. If you haven't yet, go ahead and press that subscribe button. Um, go ahead and give this video a like if you liked it. Um, otherwise, that's the uh, end of my video. I'm going to be heading home now. All right. Safe rides.